What up, Tube? We are up early. It is 7 a.m. in Nashville. Wifey's inside getting some coffee or, and some breakfast, and we'll be taking that on the road. We're going to be heading towards Knoxville, Tennessee. Uh, we're going to stop at Burgess Falls and do a hike down to the Burgess Falls. Uh, and uh, don't know if I'll be talking through that, but I'll at least give you some video footage of that. And then uh, our stop for the night in Knoxville. First, we're going to go visit our friends at Scott's Hot Rods. If you don't know who they are, they make awesome chassis, um, new frame chassis layouts for classic uh, cars. Uh, our good friend Jay Beasy, or Jeff, um, he is... Uh, going to meet us there well he works there of course he's going to meet us there we're going to you know see justin and cam and the guys we know them well we'll be staying with jeff tonight so we'll take you around scott's hot rods uh they used to be based out of ventura california now they're based out of knoxville tennessee they moved there about three years ago and their facility is awesome so it'll be a cool cool car stop there and then tomorrow tale of the dragon stay tuned real foggy. We're about, uh, I don't know, an hour maybe outside of Nashville. It's, uh, it's nice. It's cold. It's 45 outside and it got really foggy. It's like we're driving into uh, Silent Hill, except for it's not fiery. right onto Burgess Falls Road, then your destination will be y'all enjoyed that uh, little footage from Burgess Falls it's about halfway between Nashville and Knoxville about an hour and a half east of Nashville off I-40 just look it up google it if you're up this way uh, it's a drive all the way down to the main parking lot and then uh, there's two trails the main trailhead which is the more strenuous trail uh, is the lower one and then there's a higher trail that looks like an access road. It's kind of a gravel road That one is flatter. There is some elevation change, but there's no You know off-roadiness uh, Either route is about a half mile uh, You don't have to walk all the way to the big falls. There's the little falls and there's the big falls But uh, it's definitely worth the walk. So it's about a mile and a half round trip walking You can do it. It's fun. It's worth it beautiful weather currently 57 degrees we are at 1180 miles total and we're off to Knoxville hi here to see Jeff Jeff all right let me hang on hang on so Jeff took us around gave us a nickel tour of Scott's hot rods this is the lobby and the back area is all the manufacturing stuff. So Scott's Hot Rods will build you a full chassis for your classic car or truck. They will fully assemble it for you and send it out to you. I'm gonna wait a little while, but they also do full builds as well as you can see that's some of their projects, their back lot. There's a full assembly on 
the uh, chassis. So they can send it out to you complete with shocks, brakes, brake lines, everything fitted to it. You just throw your body on it. They also have not gotten away from building full cars. As you can see here, some of the projects are building for some customers uh, that they're getting ready to get out the door and finish up. We found a spray and wash in Knoxville. And as you can see, we just use the power spray off the spray and wash, get the heavy stuff off the side of the car, the wheels, all that. And then we just did a rinseless wash with the stuff we brought in the parking lot. You see the walk around, she's clean again. That's 1300 miles of driving washed off the car in less than an hour. This is my boy's 68 Pontiac and their Jeep. They were nice enough to let us stay in their house tonight here in Knoxville. Beautiful Pontiac. Thank you, Jeff. We're going to bed. It's late. We're tired. Tomorrow, Tale of the Dragon.